this is part two of, so you're thinking about starting a home gym. You've already purchased a piece, your first piece of equipment, whether it be cardio or strength building equipment, and you're ready to buy your next per piece of equipment. What should you get? Well, the next piece of equipment is not very expensive. It's matter of fact, it's under $100. In some cases, it can be under $20. And that is an exercise band. This is a Monster Light band. You can get just a regular mini, regular mini band. And the reason I recommend getting bands is, bands are a very universal piece of equipment. You can do band pull parts, which work your real delts. You can do band press downs, which work your triceps. You can hook them to the barbell and get both positive and negative resistance. You can, um, you can hook them to the chin bar if you're not strong enough to do chins. It'll actually help you, assist you in doing chins. It's just a very, very good piece of equipment that's very inexpensive. You could, if you can do band leg curls with it, you can, uh, it's just possibilities are endless. And I highly recommend that you get, get some bands. These bands are not just for strength athletes, even bodybuilders can use them. And I've seen it recently. Uh, some bodybuilders like to use them on incline press, bench press. And another thing too, Let's say you you only have dumbbells that go up to 50 pounds, but at the gym you use 80 or 90 pound dumbbells. Well, you can simply take a band, put it around your back like this. Check it out. Put the dumbbells here, and then when you press, you'll get the added resistance up top. So it'll be equivalent to using a heavy band. I mean, not a heavy band, but actually a heavy dumbbell. So that's another option of why you should purchase bands. They're relatively cheap. I would suggest buying at least two or, you know, a pair. But if that's too expensive right now or you really just don't want to spend a lot of money, one band would be sufficient to do several exercises, actually. So that's my tip for, so you're thinking about starting a home gym part two. Stay tuned for part three coming soon. Thank you. Goodbye.